Good evening, everybody, as we welcome you to this Fuller Digital Solutions podcast. I am your announcer tonight, Bryce Williams, here, as I am a junior at South O'Brien, but will be announcing the HMS game as I did last night, as the HMS Hawks will take on the Trinity Christian Tigers here. Trinity Christian comes in one and one here on the year, dropping their first one, but winning their last one, hoping to make it two straight. Starting lineups for the Tigers are Mesa, Mesa Cleveringa, Karen Eitenbogen, Micaiah Dieger, Kirsten Brummel, and, and Madeline Biss. They lost their first game by five points, but won a strong game up against HLP by ten. They have a stout defense. Offense has weak points, mainly just turnovers. Come, they tend to commit a bit of fouls. They space the floor, and they shoot a lot. So that's why a lot of their averages are down. Not that they're bad, just that they're shooting a lot. Kind of like a Russell Westbrook. As the camera has yet to turn on, that is due to it'll turn on at 6 as it's in the settings. But for your HMS Hawks, as starting at point guard, we have number 2, Gracie Knobloch. Number 14, we have, I'll say it correct tonight, Kaylee Skipoff here. As small forward, we have junior, Abby Dalma. Power forward, we have sophomore, Mariah Otto. As center, at center, we have Frankie Moni, the seniors. Her and Knobloch are the captains of the starting lineup. And the three off the bench that the Hawks tend to go to the most are Addison Sheila, number 10, junior. Van Ness, Lindsey Van Ness here, number four, sophomore. And number 15, junior, Cameron Ebel. They dropped their first two in uh, pretty polarizing losses. Lard Martin, but one last night up against Woodbury Central by 25 here as they're looking to make it two straight. As it was a very close first half last night, uh, Dalmo had a very good first half. Skipoff was kept in check. And then in the third quarter, Skipoff scored 14 points and really just opened up the game. They have a very good offense. Their defense tend to have some weak points. Uh, mainly allowing threes, but that's just because the teams can't go into the paint because they have three girls that are near six feet, two that are six feet, and skip off the other one at 5'11 listed. As they are by far the taller team here, the tallest member of the Tigers stands 5'10, as 5'10 would be the fourth tallest here on this HMS Hawks team. As we have a minute and 40 left here till opening tip off, we'll be back for the first tip off here on Florida Solutions. Whether you are combining, hauling grain, or heating your home, fuel powers the fall. When it comes to energy, you need a company who is trustworthy, understands your needs, and who delivers to you. A company who is local, reliable, and affordable. That company is Ag State. Ag State Energy is clean, comfortable, convenient, while staying competitively priced for our customers. Give Laura Sanguin or Seth Duff a call for all your energy needs. At Century Mutual, we're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in Tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual. El Grisma Agency in Sanborn, real estate and insurance. For 40 years, El Grisma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale will turn into sale pending soon. El Grisma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season on and off the field and court. Contact El Grisma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at elgrismaagency.com. Forget the ramps and hassles when hauling. They are built to tilt. Tilt bed trailers made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. We're excited to now offer one of the best tilt bed trailers on the market, ranging from 22 to 28 feet in length. Like everything we manufacture, these trailers are built to work. 
last, and make your life easier. All with confidence when you hook up to a tilt bed trailer made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. Visit us online today at HolsteinMFG.com. MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Brimgard, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rayner. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Directorate and Premium. I chose the NCC CNA course because I just really liked the instructors and the entire NCC community, how welcoming everybody is. And I was able to take it in high school and get it done before I started college. The new facility here at NCC has been great. You've got every tool you can think of. You're never struggling to find something. Just the facility as a whole has been awesome. It makes the learning a lot more interesting and a lot more hands-on. and It's just been great. Sanborn Savings Bank understands the best things grow with care and time. Sanborn Savings Bank is here not only to help you grow to your potential, but our entire community. From small beginnings to grand celebrations, Sanborn Savings Bank is here to support your journey every step of the way. This Christmas, let's celebrate growth, prosperity, and a bright future ahead. Sanborn Savings Bank, growing with you this holiday season and beyond. to get underway here in Hartley. Tip it off will be skip it off. Skip it off. Excuse me. Not going to have that again. Skip off. And skip off will bat that and the Hawks will have the first as the pass knob block to skip off from three as the early shot is off. Here's bringing it up here will be Cleveringa. Cleveringa moves inside. Pass out of bounds is the pass we went to go to Makai Mac Dieger there, but was out of bounds. Just shot behind him. Bringing it up here will be Frankie Money. As Money, bring it up here, skip off. Skip off. To Knobloch. Knobloch, dribbling. Skip off. Money. Money. Knobloch, downloader. Auto, auto, kick back to Knobloch. Knobloch will shoot that. If she had that open. As Ball will retain HMS position after the rebound attempt by Abby Dalma there. 
as now block inbound to Moni. Moni will pop that straight off the inbound as they will just let that go out of bounds. It's here in the first minute. Does not look like we'll be having a basket here. As the Hawks, they're kind of a momentum team. They play based off the momentum. And so when they're hot, their team their team size, the first basket as just at the minute mark is scored by number 12. That is Makaya Diego. As Knobloch decides what to do, hands it to Moni. Moni thinks about popping it from deep range. Knobloch open for three. Knobloch will shoot that up as that will rim out. As they will get an over the back foul on Otto. Early foul there from Otto here as the Hawks will have their first foul of the night. Six minutes and 40 seconds to go. Tigers up by two. Bringing it up is the Jaeger. The Jaeger to Viss. Put that up is Clever Inga, but they will say that that's off on a Hawk as the Tigers will retain possession here with 23 seconds left on the shot clock. As down low, number 12, the Jaeger, that will not count as that will be a floor foul there as remove the basket. As Tigers figuring out how to let inbound, it will be Aiton Bogren. Aiton. As down low, going to work is number 20. That will be blocked by Zalma. 20 on 20 action down there. It's Kirsten Brummel with the block, or with the shot attempt there. As Moni passed down to Otto. Otto will go up for that one, but stiff defense there from the Trinity Kirsten Tigers. As bringing it up, here's Diego. Jaeger to Viss. Viss over to Jaeger. Jaeger has space in the corner. Pump fakes. Drives in. Jaeger will go up with that one, and that one is good. As she has four points. The first four points of this game belonging to Jaeger. As on the inbound, Frankie Moni. Up to Otto. Otto driving, making her way to the basket. As right there, momentum couldn't stop her. There will be an early substitution here. As Lindsay Vanis will check in for Gracie Knobloch here. Knobloch will sub out quite early tonight. As the Jaeger bringing it up here. The Jaeger decides to kick that back out as that was tipped by a Hawk. As Eiton Bogard will have it. Bogard going up as that will be stripped away by the Hawks, but that will be a jump ball. As Tigers will retain possession. As the Tigers lead early 4-0 here with 5 minutes and 23 seconds left here in this first quarter. As inbound to Diego. 12 seconds on the shot clock. Diego. Over to Cleveringa. Cleveringa. As driving in, calling for the pass, there will be Aiton Bogart as she will have her first points of the night. As Tigers keeping this momentum going here, as Aiton Bogart will have her first of the night, as that will be an out of bounds call there on the Hawks as Tigers will take over. As more substitution coming in, Knobloch will come in for Moni. And number 12. Of Alyssa Twees will have it as this Cleveringa to Diego. Diego pass the Viss back to Cleveringa. Cleveringa drive, put back, kick out to Madeline Viss, pass up the shot. Diego will drive up for that one as that is off, but offensive rebound by the Tigers as Viss will pop that three as that just goes a little bit too strong off the back of the backboard. As skip off, we'll have it here. Skip off, Knobloch. Knobloch rifled down to Van Ester. She will be awarded two shots at the line there after the foul down low on the shot.
as Venice will be awarded two shots here at the line. As the first one is up and good as the Hawks will have their first point of the night off of Van Ness free throw. Van Ness, that'll be in and out as nice effort there by Twees, but just went out of bounds off her arm as Venice will walk out of the two shots with only one make, but that is the first point of the night for the Hawks. Just maybe what they need to try and get some offense going here. This is a long pass to Diego. Diego from three. Is That looks good, but that was just shallow. That will completely miss the rim as Skip Off will have her first foul of the night. A little bit of contact made down low, so Skip Off will be called there. As Otto will check out for... As Dama will check out for Otto. As wide open for three is Claveringa. is just a little bit too strong once again. As that will be in as two Unity Christian Tigers. Trinity Christian Tigers, excuse me, collide. As the Hawks will have the ball here just under halfway through. The first quarter here. Now block bringing it up. Now block. Pass on the skip off. There will be a foul there on Madeline. This, I believe. As I will be on this, it is the second team foul here tonight. As skip off, we'll check out here. Now block with the rebound. With the inbound, excuse me. As Moni is back in, skip off will take your seat on the bench. Out of a shot, Van Ness in the corner. Is that just off the near side of the rim? Is the Hawks trying to get some offense going here? As a nice pass break up there by Nablock, because that'll be picked off as she's bringing it up past halfway. Nablock deciding to go left with it. Over to Van Ness. Van Ness, nice pass to Otto. As Otto will put that up kind of wonky as she will get her own board, but she'll be awarded two shots there on the foul, on the shooting foul there. as Otto with her first, as that is off, as some um, substitution being made here, it's clever and gun this, we'll check out for Alice Brummel Sr., and number 24, I believe, is the second one, we'll, as she will go over for 2 there, as Ava Klein and Alice Brummel will come in as Hawks. Ball went out on the Tigers as Hawks will retain possession after a missed free throws. As Viss got checked out because she has two fouls already. Is catch and shoot there opportunity for Eliza Tweet as that almost goes out, does not. As Van S just touches it as it's going out of bounds. As luck of the draw there is the Hawks will retain possession here. As Micaiah Dieger. Micaiah, pass. Down low. Pass out to Micaiah. Micaiah driving. As she will go up with that, as that is off. Rebound there by Otto, as it appears. Yep, it will be Otto. Bringing it up here is Moni. Moni has it from three. She will unleash as offensive rebound there by Tweese. As Tweese will put that up, as that is good. As Tweese will have her first basket of the night, as it is the Hawks' first floor basket here. As down low, Eitan Bogard for the three. She will pop that, as that is a little bit strong off. It. As going for the rebound will be number 22, Ava Klein. But just a little too strong and took her out of bounds. As Asu Cheeler here will come in for Twees. And Dama and Dama and HMS Hawks will take a timeout. We will take a full one with them. We'll be back here in six. 
Savings Bank of Kerngar, Hartley, and Lake Park has been serving Northwest Iowa for over 125 years, providing personal, hardworking, and friendly service to its customers and community. Savings Bank of Hartley offers personal, ag and business banking, online and mobile banking solutions, along with many lending options. Savings Bank loan officers will sit down and do the hard work to ensure you get exactly what you need. Stop by and see what they can do for you or visit them online at www.savingsbankia.com. Bismographics in Sanborn, your one-stop sign shop for everything from vehicle wraps, lettering, fleet graphics, signs of all kinds, race car wraps, power sport wraps, banners, logo design, business cards, or even color change vehicle wraps. Everything is done in-house with top-of-the-line equipment. Stefan and Ashley Seabisma employ an experienced and knowledgeable staff who are ready to work for you. To help get you noticed, visit cbisma-graphics.com. Find us on Facebook or call 712-729-7446. As we welcome you back here on your next night, Bryce Williams here. As Moni will pop that three as that is off. As they'll get in over the over the back foul here on Otto is skip skip off will check in here. As Mariah Otto will check out here for skip off. Skip off on a bright pink shoes. Just bringing it up here is number 12, Micaiah. Micaiah to Brummel. Brummel drives in for the basket there. As excuse me, that is Aiton Bogart. As she will have her second basket of the night. As that'll be stolen by the Hawks there. As that'll be a jump ball. Hawks will earn possession there as the fans call for a travel. None given here as the Tigers lead 8-3 here. One minute and 46 seconds left here in this first quarter. As Sheeler passed on to Dalma. Dalma put up and she'll be a word to you there on the shooting foul there. As Dalma would take her first shots at the line here tonight. As he first one with a high arc, there, kind of a rainbow shot, remind me of Larry Bird right there. As she will have her first points of the night. Can she make it two? Is it she will? As Dalma now has two, Twees also has two, and Vanessa has a single free throw. As the Hawks trail five to eight here, a minute and a half left in this first quarter of action. As down low, as nice strip there by Sheeler. Knoblock will steal it. Knoblock looking to pass to, but we'll bring it up here as that'll go out of bounds on Sheeler. As great opportunity there for the Hawks to score some points, but the Tigers will get possession. Let's bring it up here is Makaya. Makaya over that Brummel. Quick pass there, catch and shoot by Eitan Bogart as skip off will get the rebound. As they will take a half time out. Take this changes everything. TiVo is here. Search and control your cable channels and streaming video with one remote. Use voice activation to find everything faster or set a one-pass recording. Then watch on any TV in your home or browse and view on Wi-Fi devices with the free View It app. Contact TCA to experience TiVo today. As we welcome back here this first quarter of action here in Hartley's Iowa, I'm your announcer tonight, Bryce Williams here. As the Hawks trail early 5-8, here with a minute and four seconds left here in the first quarter. As pass here up to Sheeler. Sheeler pass up an open opportunity. As tries to get it down under Dama. Sheeler questioning here decision there. 
Schiller. Inbound to skip off. Skip off with a three. Catch and shoot. Is that as good for her skip first basket of the night? Is that first made three for the Hawks tonight? As we are all tied up here at eight with just under four, 50 seconds here to play. As pass over number 22. 22 will put that up as that will be a jump ball as Tigers will have possession here. As with the shot, on the shot there, is Ava Klein. As Knobloch will take a hard fall to the floor here. As Makaya will shoot that. Excuse me, that was Rumble that will shoot that. As the Hawks tra struggling to get a rebound down low. As for their height, they should be able to do that quite well. As there's no shot clock, so they are not forced to take a shot here. At least anytime soon. As Brummel will have, or Makai, excuse me, will have bases. The Hawks will get their third offensive rebound of this possession. As just under 10 seconds here. Kick out as that will be a travel. Moving the feet just a little too much on the step back. And the Hawks will get out of that disaster of a possession on defense. As they allowed four offensive rebounds there. Bring it up here fast is Moni. Moni skip off call for it. Moni will kick it over to Knobloch. Knobloch will shoot it and up in just over it. Possible buzzer beater there to take a lead. But at the end of one, we are tied 8-8 eight, eight here. And we'll be back here in six seconds. Mutual. We're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in Tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual Reinsurance company as we are looking back here the second quarter of your action here Gracie Knobloch will be here with the inbound as skip off for Moni will be taken most likely Moni here as Moni will be passing it up pass attempt down low to Dalma as Makai in transition Makai will shoot that as that is good as fast basket here to start the second Quarter here. Skip off will pass down low as that is picked off once again as Makai Dieger and Karen Eiton Bogart have all 10 points for the Tigers here. As fans want to travel as Bogart will go up for that one as Bogart will have that. She now has eight here early. As that'll be Tiger Ball as they will take as the Hawks will take a full time out to recoup and repossess here. We'll take one with them. We'll be back. El Grisma Agency in Sanborn, real estate and insurance. For 40 years, El Grisma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale will turn into sale pending soon. El Grisma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season on and off the field and court. Contact El Grisma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at elgrismaagency.com. Forget the ramps and hassles when hauling. They are built to tilt. Tilt bed trailers made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. We're excited to now offer one of the best tilt bed trailers on the market, ranging from 22 to 28 feet in length. And like everything we manufacture, these trailers are built to work, last, and make your life easier. All with confidence when you hook up to a tilt bed trailer made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. Visit us online today at HolsteinMFG.com.
as we welcome you back here this second quarter. I'm your next time, Bryce Williams here, Jr. over at South O'Brien. I've done some basketball announcing before. This year's my first full year. As the inbound here, Micaiah will we'll have it. Micaiah over to Klein, back to Micaiah. Micaiah will swing that over to Eiton Bogart. As Eiton Bogart will put that up as she will bury the three there. As her, as Eiton Bogart and Micaiah have all 15 points there, as Micaiah now has seven. As excuse me, Karen will have seven. As Makai will have the other eight here, as there will be a defensive foul on the Tigers there. Knobloch in by Moni. Moni to Knobloch. Knobloch decides to dribble. Knobloch skip off to Moni. Moni. Back skip off. Skip off with the three. As that rolls in and out, it's rebounded there by Willow Postma. As Klein will go for that one, as she will face some contact there. As Klein will score the first non, non two girls basket of the night. As Knobloch barrels into the scores table over there. As Mariah Otto will check in for Abby Dama here as the Hawks have not scored a basket here in this second quarter. Only a minute and a half in, but have allowed nine. All down low, which is very much not like the Hawks. As that will be picked off by the Hawks, right as they say. As Knobloch will bring it up court here. Knobloch to skip off, skip off. Passes it all the way to the other end. As Otto will look to make her way into the paint as she will go up with that one. As that will be out. A uh, rebound by Ava Klein, Eva Klein there. As Micaiah drives in, step out to number four. Number four will put that up. Eitan Bogart as that will be missed there. As that will be a foul on Micaiah there. That will be her first of the night. Checking in here is Kier Kirsten Brummel and Mesa Cleveringa. As Micaiah will take her first seat of the night. As well as Eitan Bogard. So those are two subs there. It's hard foul there. Is number 12. That is Twees. Eliza Twees. As Twees made a basket early on in the first quarter here. As she is hoping to get her second chance points of the night as Twees first shot is up and good as she now moves up to three points as the second is up and good as she now has four on the night as bringing it up here fast is Cleveringa Cleveringa pass all the way over to Ava Klein as Ava Klein will shoot that three. That'll be just out. That look have been tipped off of Mariah Otto. But Hawks will take possession as skip off Twees and Knobloch will check out here as Vaness, Moni, and Sheeler are into the game as pass up to Sheeler. Sheeler will go up with it as they will get Sheeler with a charge there. As the Tigers will commit a transition foul there. As Clever and Good bring it up here. Working it down low. Pass out to number 10. That was off the rookie shot is Alice Brown. There will be uh, the fourth foul of the quarter on the Tigers. As they are one away from entering the bonus here, with still five minutes left to play here. 
Esmoni past Sheeler. Sheeler pass it down low. Otto. Otto going up with it. As that'll be the first Hawk basket of the sec second quarter here. As she now has four, she's the Hawks' leading scorer. As down low. Pat going up with it there is number 20. That is Kirsten Rummel. She has her first basket on the night. As going up with that one was Dama, but Dama misses. As now bringing it up is Cleveringa. Cleveringa pass. As Brummel will have that as bringing it up here is Otto. Otto in transition. As there will be a blocking foul as the Tigers will now enter the bonus there. As every Hawk, every Tiger foul now will result in two free throws guaranteed for the Hawks here. New rules this year eliminate one plus one opportunity. So eat every bonus foul is a guaranteed two free throws. As Otto on the first one is good. She now has five. As mass substitution there as Aiden Bogard, Micaiah, and Viss will check back into the game. As the second is good as Otto now has six here. As bringing it up here is Cleveringa. As this will have a travel here. As inbound here for the Hawks is Gracie Knobloch. Moni bringing it up here. Over Knobloch. Knobloch. Pass over to Sheeler. Sheeler. Moni, Moni for three is that will just go off his offensive rebound there, but Otto, Otto now has eight. There as skip off. Will be ready to check into the game here. Viss has the ball in the perimeter. Pass down to Viss, that will be bounced off as Knobloch will be carried into the steal there. Knobloch bringing it up court here as the Hawks trail by only three here. As there will be. Hard contact on autos. Autos making their way up the court. As Viss for three. Viss will pop that, and that is off near side. Off of the rebound by Cleveringa. As when an auto hawk defender. As Skip Off will check in here for Otto. As inbound Aiden Bogard. Viss will make her way to the basket unguarded. As she will have two, her first two of the night. As they take a five point lead as Moni out to Knobloch. Knobloch over to Skip Off. Skip Off with the three. As that is very from deep as she now has six on the game off two threes. As the Hawks grab only two once again. This is first 21 like street ball. This game would be over but this is standard basketball so I guess we will not be getting out of here anytime soon as the Tigers moving the ball around as there was three steps taken right there as the light decision to pass it and bite them as they as the Tigers will turn over the ball there as Trinity Christian will take a 30 second time MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. As we welcome back here to the final two minutes, just under two and a half minutes left in the second quarter of action here as the Hawks are in the bonus here. As every Tigers foul will result two shots guaranteed at the line as Moni will heat chuck that up here to Tweese. Tweese 
Skip off for three. Skip off. We'll pop that. Is that is off, but there will be a Gracie Knobloch foul down in the low post. Uh, that will be the second Hawks foul of the quarter. There's still three fouls to give. But costly turnover there for the Hawks is possibly could have tied up the game. As covering up. As it looked like a kind of from here good flop job there from from Micaiah. As in on the inbound it's Aiton Bogard. As Aiton Bogard in the clevering, excuse me, not pass, all the way up to Micaiah. Micaiah will pass that around. Base. Chris Cleveringa. Micaiah. As that'll be passed all the way up. As Micaiah with the three, as that will be just off. As just a little too much mustard on that one. As this will remain a two point game here. Skip off on the three. As Ben S with the three to put the Hawks up, and they will have their first lead of the night here. As she now has four in the ball game. As the Hawks now lead 22-21 here, as the Tigers will have a near out of bounds there on Aiton Bogard. As but they will keep it in. As that will go out, and the Hawks will have balls. What a swing of momentum here! As the Hawks were down by nine points. But two and a half minutes into this quarter and now they are up one in the final minute. Knobloch, Van S, Van S over the head of Abidama. Just under a minute left to play here before halftime. As Micaiah will drive up for it as she will be the, given the and one there. As Micaiah now has 10 here in the first half. As will she make it 11? Yes, she will. As the Hawks are now up by two once again. 54 seconds left here in the second quarter. As nice inbound pass here. Van S going up grabbing it. As skip off will go up for that one. As that is good. As that is her third basket of the night. Now has eight here. It's her and Otto both have eight. As just about 10 seconds separating the shot clock in game clock here as the second quarter is lined down. Biss with the three. This is, that will be an air ball. As Skip Off will bring it up here. No shot clock here. We are under 30 seconds here. As Skip Off with the three and she'll pass down. The Tweez, Tweez will be given two fouls either way. So waiting on the call and then realize that they are on the bonus here. So... No matter what foul, the Hawks will be given two shots here at the line. As the first shot here by Tweese is off. As so far this game is remaining tied. Can Tweese untie is the question here. 21 seconds left to go. As Tweese will go 0 for 2 at the line there as the rebound by Makaya. Makaya bringing up court here. Slow it down a little bit. 15 to play. They will be looking for a last shot here, I believe. As Cleveringa, Cleveringa down as Aiton Bogard for three. Is that is just off there? As no shot will be given there as we will hit halftime. As it is a tie game, 24-24 here. Going into the second half, we'll be right back for some halftime show here in about eight minutes. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Primgard, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rayner. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Direct Written Premium. Probably the biggest thing that we do a little bit different than a lot of schools is the live work side of the world. 
So when we teach our students, we actually, if you look around the shop and see what they're working on, in most cases it's a customer car, and so they get real world application. Our engineering design program is basically drawing components, manufacturing of the components, and then we get into the inspection of the components. So they got to create it, make it, and inspect it just as they would in industry. Sanborn Savings Bank understands the best things grow with care and time. Sanborn Savings Bank is here not only to help you grow to your potential, but our entire community. From small beginnings to grand celebrations, Sanborn Savings Bank is here to support your journey every step of the way. This Christmas, let's celebrate growth, prosperity, and a bright future ahead. Sanborn Savings Bank, growing with you this holiday season and beyond. Trustworthy, honest, and hardworking. The same traits that make a great employee make a great bank. For 125 years, Savings Bank of Primgar, Hartley, and Lake Park has been going the extra mile providing banking to farms and small businesses in Northwest Iowa. Savings Bank of Hartley prides itself on knowing you, your operation, your goals, and your future plans to help you along the way so you can focus on what you do best. Stop in today or visit them online at savingsbankia.com. Bismarck Graphics in Sanborn, your one-stop sign shop for everything from vehicle wraps, lettering, fleet graphics, signs of all kinds, race car wraps, power sport wraps, banners, logo design, business cards, or even color change vehicle wraps. Everything is done in-house with top-of-the-line equipment. Stefan and Ashley Seabisma employ an experienced and knowledgeable staff who are ready to work for you. To help get you noticed, visit cbisma-graphics.com. Find us on Facebook or call 712-729-7446. This changes everything. TiVo is here. Search and control your cable channels and streaming video with one remote. Use voice activation to find everything faster or set a one-pass recording. Then watch on any TV in your home or browse and view on Wi-Fi devices with the free View It app. Contact TCA to experience TiVo today. As we welcome back here for this little halftime show, won't be nothing too long, but nothing short. As HMS and Trinity Christian Tigers, you're tied up 24-24 here going into the halftime. Skip off and Otto both have eight for the Hawks. Venice has four and Twees also has four. As only four players have scored points here for the Hawks. As they're keeping the ball moving, although they're getting out rebound tonight. As last night up against a bigger Woodbury Central team, they did quite well down low. As for Trinity Christian, on the other hand, Clevering has been dishing the ball out a lot of the game, although she was out most of the second quarter. As Karen Eitenborg Bogard has seven here in the first half. Makaya Dieger has 11. Kirsten Brummel has two. And Madeline Biss has two. And Eva Klein off the bench has two. As that will result in a 24 24 halftime. No one in foul trouble really right now. There are three players with two fouls here, Madeline Biss. Matt, excuse me. Madeline Biss, Ella Twees, and Gracie Nodlock are all players of two. As we'll come back here at the start of the second half here on Florida Station, we'll move right back. Whether you are combining, hauling grain, or heating your home, fuel powers the fall. When it comes to energy, you need a company who is trustworthy, understands your needs, and who delivers to you. A company who is local, 
reliable, and affordable. That company is Ag State. Ag State Energy is clean, comfortable, convenient, while staying competitively priced for our customers. Give Laura Sanguin or Seth Duff a call for all your energy needs. As we come back here from our halftime break, here's the final second of our halftime or ticking down as a tie game coming into halftime. As we will see what this second half takes us. Can the Hawks pull ahead or will the Trinity Christian Tigers pull ahead? We, uh, we don't know, but we will 
for sure see this half as inbound here is Aizen Bogard. As Bogard into Makaya. Makaya dribbling down to Viss. Viss kick back to Aiton Bogard. Aiton Bogard with the early three. As that is good. As she now has 10 on the ninth. First basket made out of half as the Tigers go up early 27-24. As pass down low to Mariah Otto. Otto looking for where to go. Nah, block. As Otto will be awarded two shots here at the line. As Otto, first one will roll around about three or four times. As she now has nine, can she make it ten here on this one? As the second one will be no good as she has nine, but offensive rebound there by Skipic. As that'll be buried for Moaning for her first basket. As Skip off, excuse me, not Skipic. As Makaya bringing it up here. Kaya to Cleveringer. Cleveringer. As I'll be stolen away by the Hawks, there as they're bringing it up court here. Just a minute in. Hawks lead 20 27 here. As going out of the baseline will be Moni. Moni pass will be tipped to Gracie, Gracie Knobloch, excuse me. As Mariah Otto will take it here at the top. As pass back to Knobloch, just under 10. As Knobloch will put that one up as I'll go in and out. She'll put that back up as another offensive rebound there by the Hawks. As that'll be blocked out of bounds as the Hawks put up four shots right there. Two of them, three of them were rebounded offensively and the fourth one was blocked out of bounds. As Gracie Knobloch with the inbound into Mariah Otto. As Otto going up and that'll be good through the contact. She now has 11, the first. Her second straight 10 point game. She had 11 last night, I believe. As skip, skip off there with the turnover. As Dalma trailing, Dalma contends on that one, but that'll be an and one on skip off there. As going to the line, there will be number 20, Kirsten Bremel. Brummel, excuse me. And Brummel, that'll be her fourth point of the game. Brummel with the and one, as that will be good, as Brummel now has five here. Knoblock up to Moni. Moni driving. Moni out to Knoblock. Knoblock down low to Otto. Otto. Will be called for a travel there as switched her pivot foot down low. Well, as that will result in a Tigers ball here, just under two minutes to play here. Tie game 30 30. Just under two minutes gone in the second half, I meant to say. As Makaya debating where to shoot the three or not. As nice block there by Abby Dahlman there. She has been kept quiet. She has no points as last night. She had 23 against Woodbury Central tonight so far through two and a quarter quarters we have zero points as inbound to Micaiah Micaiah Cleveringer Cleveringer down low back out to Aiton Bogard but Aiton Bogard shot will be just over as rebound there by Skip it Skip off excuse me as wide open Mariah Otto there as she will get her 13th point of the game. As wide open shot there for Micaiah at the top of the post. As skip off will have that rebound once again. Back to back possessions of a Micaiah miss and a skip off rebound. As Gracie Knobloch at the three point line. As Dama will get her first points of the game here. 
with four minutes and 51 seconds left here in the third quarter. As Cleveringer over to Aiden Bogart. Cleveringer. This. This cannot control the ball, but that will be a jump ball. Here as the Hawks will take possession. As substitution will be made as number 10, Alice Brummel, will come in. And Van S will also come in. As Dalma at the top. The Hawks lead by four. Dalma down low. They're now being awarded two at the line. Here's Otto. As Otto and Dalma are big figures down there height wise, they're both over six feet as they tower over most of the centers and power forwards here. Otto's first shot is up and good as she makes that 14 now. As Otto's second will be up and too hard off the back as she will only walk out with one and she has 14. Micaiah being left open for three. You should, shouldn't say left open, just say I got for three. Sight and Bogard pass to Micaiah. Micaiah will go in there as Micaiah will put that up and not hit anything. As Tigers will get an offensive rebound. And Micaiah will shoot that for three. As that is buried from deep there. As Micaiah now has. Her 14th point of the game as that will be out of bounds on the Hawks today as the Tigers will go up by two here with three minutes 25 seconds left to go in this third quarter. Micaiah. As that will go out of bounds after a Hawk tipped it and Tigers will retain possession. As inbound from Alice to Micaiah. Back to Alice. Micaiah wide open. Pump fake drives in from about 15 as that is good. As Micaiah now has basket number 16 here. Yeah. She has 16 points. As Otto will be stripped down low in the paint. That will be a jump ball there as Tigers will take possession here as they are shifting momentum here. As is a tied game as Dalma and Knobloch will sub out here for Otto and skip off. As Micaiah. To number 10. 10 will shoot that. That's off the near side of the rim as Dalma will rebound that. As bring it up here, Moni. Moni. We'll step back a little bit. Knobloch gets the defender jumping back to Moni. Moni, Dalma, Dalma. Put it up as that is good. And she'll get her second back on the night. She now is four. As Hawks will go up two. As heck of a pass there. Over to Alice. As Micaiah to Alice. Alice will pop the three as that will roll in there for Alice Brummel. She will have her first basket on the night. As wide open in the three is Van Ness there. As that will be bumped. Micaiah will be hit hard there.
as Makaya will stay in the game. A little bit of a head injury as Brummel makes a three as the Tigers are now up over the Hawks, 38-37 here. As pass back as Makaya for three. Makaya will drive in. Post it. As Makaya pass back out. Back to Makaya as Makaya's over for three. As I can Bogard five takes left on the shot clock here. Alice Brummel. As they're deciding maybe a shot clock. As they're talking about whether to up the shot clock. As skip off and auto will come in here. As checking out is Van S and Tweese. And we are waiting a call. As I believe they're going to reset the shot clock to 25 as there was a missed shot on the possession. As Trinity Kirsten will take a timeout, we'll take one with them as we'll be right back. Century Mutual. We're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in Tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual Reinsurance Company. As we welcome you back here from the short little break, as they determine that there will be five, 25 seconds on the shot clock after a shot hit the backboard. There is catch it to by Micaiah. That will be good. As they did not reset the shot clock as Micaiah will bury that one from deep. As she now has 19, as there was just about four seconds to shoot that as Gracie Knobloch will pull that from long range, as that is buried for her first basket on the night. Score is now 41-40. Hawks lead, or Tigers lead the Hawks here in Hartley, Iowa. Alice with a wide open shot, decides not to. Eitan Bogart driving in, she'll put that up with a nice little finger roll, as she'll be awarded two shots at the line here. His first shot by Bogard with the high release. Is that bounced off the top, the very top of the backboard. As that went out as Sheeler checks in for now for skip off. As Eitan Bogard will go 0 for 2 at the line here. The score will remain 41 40 here. No shot. Needs to be forced here. But down will go down low as there will be a two shots given here at the line for down here with just 25 left to play here in this third quarter. Dama's first throw, free throw is off. Dalma's second one is up and is good. She now has five on the night. Excuse me, she has now seven on the night. As decide not to pass that shot up as Eitan Bogard passed down low. 
is that shot will be attempted as the there will be a jump ball called as that will be Hawks ball 2.9 seconds left here in this third quarter as Moni bringing it up here as that shot will be high off the shot clock there as we will come into the fourth quarter tied 41-41 here with just eight minutes left to go in this ball game. Will, which team will pull it out? El Grisma Agency in Sanborn, real estate and insurance. For 40 years, El Grisma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale will turn into sale pending soon. El Grisma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season, on and off the field and court. Contact El Grisma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at elgrismaagency.com. As we walk him back here, as the camera just shortcut me here, as it showed it was still on commercial, but it wasn't. As we walk him back here at, to start this fourth quarter, as Aiton Bogard will be taking the inbound here. As guard by Navlock, Micaiah will bring it up here. As Aiton Bogard. After the pass is blocked by Jama and down the fashion right there. As bringing it up as I'll be knocked off a Trinity Christian down there in the low paint. As just 17 seconds in, two changes of possession here. As Moni will check out here. As Vaness is back in the game. As Moni has an injured left knee. As pot catch a two three by Knoblock, they'll be off. So I'm familiar with this HMS team because almost all these girls, as there'll be a blocking foul there on the shot on Knoblock, as she now has three fouls, just as many points. As most of this team plays base softball as well. As the first shot by Kirsten Brummel is off as she is looking to give the Tigers a lead here on the second. As that one will be bounced off as Sheeler with the rebound. Sheeler Van S. Van S will bring it up here. Knoblock. Knoblock Sheeler. Sheeler over to Van S. Van S downloaded Dalma. As that shot's off, Otto will go back up and she'll grab a rebound again as she will get two shots to the line. As she could be getting her... She could be getting her 14th and 15th points of the night here. As the first one is off. Skip off will check in for Sheila here. As Otto's second shot is also off as four shots here so far in this fourth quarter at the free throw line. And no team has yet to hit one. As the score is remaining through the first minute, 41-41 here. As Eitan Bogard will shoot the three. As that will be rebounded by Knoblock down there. As Knoblock to skip off, skip off with the three. As that is bounced off as that... Is a hard foul on Makaya right there. Van S will be the one to receive the foul. Yeah. 
as Micaiah over to Eigen, Eigen Bogard. As Madison Liz will go up to that one. As that one is off as no points yet, almost two minutes to this game. As skip off will not make it, as there will be a jump ball there as the Hawks will retain possession. As 6.14 left, score remains 41-41 here. As shot to Otto, Otto will put that up as once again, both teams have yet to score here in this fourth quarter as the scores remain tied. As that shot will be made for the first points of the quarter by Nakaya. As she now has 21, I believe. And pass down low to Dama. Dama will go up and over. As two Hawks down there. But Kirsten Brum will come with the rebound. And Micaiah for three is that will completely miss everything. As that will go out of bounds as Hawks get a quick break right here. As skip off will inbound back to Gracie Knobloch. Knobloch to skip off. Skip off can dribble. Knobloch playing the perimeter. Van Ness for mid range. As the midi right there is hit by Van Ness. So she now has six in the game. As Eitan Bogard to Cleveringer. As Viz, Pellinger, Eitan Bogard. Eitan Bogard back to Eitan Bogard. Over to Makaya. Makaya for three. That is just long. A skip off with the rebound here as Nabok will bring it up. Nabok to skip off. And great pink shoes. Van S for three. As that will go just off there. As rebounded by Makaya Dieger there. As she has a sister on the team. Jay Lady Ager, as that will be blocked out of bounds, and that will be Hawks ball here. As Vanessa will check out here, the Moni will check back in, playing on a little bit of an injured left knee here. So limited mobility. As Knobloch pass up to skip off, skip off. Will drive. Moni. Skip off. Skip off will drive in and she'll put that up. And that is good as the Hawks have the lead. As Skip off now has 10 on the game. And Cleveringer. Pass out to Micaiah. Micaiah. Back to Cleveringer. As Brummel will be blocked out there by Gama. As bring it up here by Skip Off. Skip Off. Moni. Moni. Over to wide open Gracie Knobloch. Knobloch will pop that for three. As that is just bounced off. As there will be a push on the offensive rebound here. By Mariah Otto here. So that will be her third foul on the game. As the Hawks lead 45-43 with 3 minutes and 43 seconds left to go here in this game. Tigers trying to bite back into this and keep this a close game. As this will pop that from mid-range, as that is good. As this has her only her second basket on the night. She has four as they air an inbound. Will give the Tigers possession back as the Kaya will go for that one and she now has 23 in this ball game is brought up by Gracie Nalbach to skip off skip off will go down the sideline or Moni as Abby Dalma allows a steal there as the pass is intended for her as Makai will pop up as that is off auto with the rebound as ball is tipped by Cleveringa. As HMS will take a timeout here as they're down 47-45 here to stop momentum. Can the HMS Hawks pull this off with three minutes left to go? We will see after we get back from four. 
MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Primgar, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rayner. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Directorate and Premium. As we welcome back here to this fourth quarter of play, two minutes, 49 seconds off here, Gracie Knobloch, who has three points on the night. With the inbound, Knobloch said plenty of opportunities, and money will pop that for three as that's off. As a rebound there by 22. As that is Ava Klein. Makaya bringing it up here as that is blocked by Dalma. Makaya was going for number 25 right there. But Knobloch will have it. Knobloch out to Moni. Moni for three. That rims out as that will be grabbed by Makaya. Makaya will slow it up here. Just under 220 here. It's Cleveringa. Cleveringa will bring that in as Viz. Shot is, look at them, blocked in air. As 210 left here. As Moni. Moni. Pass over to Knobloch. Knobloch down low to Otto. Otto will put that up. As it is now a tied game with just two minutes left to go here. As she now has 14 on the 15 on the night. As Makaya, she will drive in, pass out to Viz, pass out to Aiton Bogart. That is long. As on the rebound is Gracie Knobloch as Moni will bring it up. Moni, skip off, skip off, pump fake. Skip off will drive in here as she will get uh, the and one here. As she now has 12. As Skip off trying to make this a three point play here. As she will do just that. She now has 13 here. As Micaiah doing everything she can here to keep the Tigers in this game. As Viss will drive in, she'll lose the ball as Otto will bring it up here. As the Tigers seem to be falling apart here on offense. As skip off for three, pass back to Moni. Moni with the three, as that is a low arc there. Off the rebound there by skip off. As they'll be given a full timeout. Each of us will take a full timeout. We will take one with it. I chose the NCCCNA course because I just really liked the instructors and the entire NCC community, how welcoming everybody is, and I was able to take it in high school and get it done before I started college. The new facility here at NCC has been great. You've got every tool you can think of. You're never struggling to find something. Just the facility as a whole has been awesome. It makes the learning a lot more interesting and a lot more hands-on, and it's just been great. Sanborn Savings Bank understands the best things grow with care and time. Sanborn Savings Bank is here not only to help you grow to your potential, but our entire community. From small beginnings to grand celebrations, Sanborn Savings Bank is here to support your journey every step of the way. This Christmas, let's celebrate growth, prosperity, and a bright future ahead. Sanborn Savings Bank, growing with you this holiday season and beyond. As we welcome you back here to this fourth quarter in Hartley, Iowa, I am Rick, now to turn in Bryce Williams, sophomore or junior over at South O'Brien here. As the Ox try and hang on to this three point lead with one minute and 11 seconds left in the game. As Iman skip off wide open, Moni. Moni, the knob block. Hawks wonder if they're going to choose some clock here. 
ideally. Skip up wide open three. Skip off will shoot that. That is off. Offensive rebound tipped by Otto as Otto will not have it as Micaiah. Pass will be deflected by Nablock. It's just 52 left to play here. As inbound here by Eitan Bogart. Pass to Cleveringa. Cleveringa will go over. Viz with the mid range. Is that is good? They will cut back in this lead. They will give a full timeout. We'll take a break with the movie. Savings Bank of Krimgar, Hartley, and Lake Park has been serving Northwest Iowa for over 125 years, providing personal, hardworking, and friendly service to its customers and community. Savings Bank of Hartley offers personal, ag and business banking, online and mobile banking solutions, along with many lending options. Savings Bank loan officers will sit down and do the hard work to ensure you get exactly what you need. Stop by and see what they can do for you or visit them online at www.savingsbankia.com. Bisma Graphics in Sanborn, your one-stop site. One, two, one, two. Welcome back here as the ad never went to commercial here as there will be a foul on the side on the Tigers here. It's just seven seconds separating the shot clock and game clock here. As they will be given a full shot clock on this play as Gracie Nabla will inbound down low to Otto. Or Dama, Dama will go up with that one. As there will be a travel on Dalma as the crowd erupts. As the Tigers are still in this game with just 49-50 is the score. Tigers trail by one as covering up out to Eitan Bogart. Eitan Bogart three. That is off. Rebound will a foul will be on the Tigers as here you got a foul. That'll be on Micaiah there. Micaiah has three. This has four fouls, so she's one away from disqualification. Inbound to Knoblock. Or inbound to Skip Off. Skip Off. Pass down to Dama. Dama. Pass to Knoblock. Knoblock. As Micaiah will commit her third foul of the game. As they'll have to foul one more time, which is 18.8 seconds remaining. As Gracie Knobloch will miss the first one here. As that was a big free throw here. As here comes an even bigger one to put them up by at least a basket. As Gracie Knobloch with her second is money. As Knobloch will put one up as she now has four in the game as Hawks are up by two. We will take a, they will take a halftime note. We will stick with them here with just 18 seconds left to go. Wouldn't want a commercial to overshoot the ending of this brilliant ball game so far. As the Obox has only had four points tonight, but that one point right there might have been the most important of the night and at least puts HMS up by a guaranteed basket. Now, 18 seconds is more than enough time to get the Tigers a shot inside the arc. But the thing is here is, do you want to bring a game of momentum into overtime as the away team? And... We'll see what they do here. It's 18.8 seconds will remain here as the Tigers will either play for the kill or play for overtime here as they will have to inbound it. As I'll be inbound to Micaiah. Micaiah bringing it up here. As Micaiah 
of ninth and Bogard. Ten, just under 10 seconds. Micaiah, as there will be a foul, just 6.6 seconds left here. As the Hawks are one away here, and you wonder if you're the Hawks, you drive into the paint here and try and get your two free throws. As they do have a timeout, and they will use one here to regroup as they will take a full one. As we will take a half a one with them. We'll be right back here in about 30 seconds. Bisma Graphics in Sanborn, your one-stop sign shop for everything from vehicle wraps, lettering, fleet graphics, signs of all kinds, race car wraps, power sport wraps, banners, logo design, business cards, or even color change vehicle wraps. Everything is done in-house with top-of-the-line equipment. Stefan and Ashley C. Bisma employ an experienced and knowledgeable staff who are ready to work for you. To help get you noticed, visit cbisma-graphics.com. Find us on Facebook or call 712-729-7446. As we're walking back here to 20 seconds left in this timeout here, as I think if you're the Hawks here, you play for an inside the arc play here because at least you get overtime. Or you can pass the ball into Micaiah, the Eager, and play for the kill shot here. As I don't think you'd want to take this HMS team to overtime just because it's truly a game of momentum. It's a huge gamble there. And I don't know if the Trinity Christian Tigers like the odds of that gamble there. As Ian Bogard will pass it in to Micaiah. Micaiah just four seconds up. This will go up for that one. As that will be blocked out of bounds with just two seconds left to go here. As the Tigers will have to get a shot up and off quick here. As they're playing Micaiah. Here as they will inbound it here. As the inbound will go to Micaiah. Or Clevenger as that will be off. As the HMS Hawks will block the game winning shot there. As HMS will hold on to win this thing 51-49 here at the end. Hawks fought and fought and fought in this game. And they ended up on top. In the first half they are playing from behind for most of it. But in the second half tides turned and at halftime it was 24-24 and in the second half there was 27 and 25 points scored and as the boys game will be up next we'll take a short road break and be on in a bit here on Florida Solutions this changes everything TiVo is here search and control your cable channels and streaming video with one remote Use voice activation to find everything faster or set a one-pass recording. Then watch on any TV in your home or browse and view on Wi-Fi devices with the free View It app. Contact TCA to experience TiVo today. Century Mutual. We're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in Tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual reinsurance company. El Grisma Agency and Sanborn Real Estate and Insurance. For 40 years, El Grisma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale 
will turn into sale pending soon. El Grisma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season on and off the field and court. Contact El Grisma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at elgrismaagency.com. Forget the ramps and hassles when hauling. They are built to tilt. Tilt bed trailers made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. We're excited to now offer one of the best tilt bed trailers on the market, ranging from 22 to 28 feet in length. And like everything we manufacture, these trailers are built to work, last, and make your life easier. All with confidence when you hook up to a tilt bed trailer made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. Visit us online today at HolsteinMFG.com.
as we welcome you to tonight's broadcast of the boys game of Trinity Christian versus Hartley Mountain Sanborn. I'm your not to tonight, Bryce Williams here. It's two minutes, 50 seconds till opening tip off. Here is the HMS Hawks coming in this game 0-2 as the Trinity Christian Tigers come in this 1-1. The starting lineup for Trinity Christian is Pierce Gron Gronweg at point guard senior. Uh, number 12, junior Carter Westra. Number 20, junior Reed Gronweg. 24, Dustin Locksbergen. And number 32, Luke DeYoung. As they came in winning their last one, Trinity Christian did. As they come into this one and one. As, excuse me, they won their first one and lost their last one to George Lowrock by 13. As it shows that they were just kind of beat right off the rip. That they were kind of playing from behind the entire game. They outscored them in the second half, but the hole too, was too big to fill in the first half. As for your HMS Hawks, we have at point guard, Jaden Lesh. At shooting guard, we have Josh Cruz. At small forward, we have Leighton Skipoff. At power forward, we have the big shooter, Bradley Van B. In at center, we have Alex Billings. Billings, a board monster down there. Van Beek, the one that stretches the floor and shoots the threes. Skip off. I'd like to see the ball more in his hands tonight. Didn't get the ball much in a scoring opportunity last time out. But we would hopefully he gets the ball more today. As we will be back in about a minute, a minute and a half here on Florida Solution as the camera will turn back on here at about 7.45. MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Primgar, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rader. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Direct Written Premium. Probably the biggest thing that we do a little bit different than a lot of schools is the live work side of the world. So when we teach our students, we actually, if you look around the shop and see what they're working on, in most cases it's a customer car, and so they get real world application. Our engineering design program is basically drawing components, manufacturing of the components, and then we get into the inspection of the components. So they got to create it, make it, and inspect it just as they would in industry. Sanborn Savings Bank understands the best things grow with care and time. Sanborn Savings Bank is here not only to help you grow to your potential, but our entire community. From small beginnings to grand celebrations, Sanborn Savings Bank is here to support your journey every step of the way. This Christmas, let's celebrate growth, prosperity, and a bright future ahead. Sanborn Savings Bank, growing with you this holiday season and beyond. Oh Trustworthy, honest, and hardworking. The same traits that make a great employee make a great bank. For 125 years, Savings Bank of Primgar, Hartley, and Lake Park has been going the extra mile providing banking to farms and small businesses in Northwest Iowa. Savings Bank of Hartley prides itself on knowing you, your operation, your goals, and your future plans to help you along the way so you can focus on what you do best. Stop in today or visit them online at savingsbankia.com. Bismarck Graphics in Sanborn, your one-stop sign shop for everything from vehicle wraps, lettering, fleet graphics, signs of all kinds. As we will come
come back with it here. Just buying enough time to get the camera up and working. As we are just getting ready to tip up, Jaden Lish will meet up with Dustin Hawksbergen at the line. As ball getting shifted around, Hawksbergen with the ball. Hawksbergen pass. Ball moving around very well. Westra will go in as Pierce Gronick will make a fancy little pass. As number 32 right there, Luke DeYoung, gets fouled there. As he'll be shooting two here. Or it'll be a ground foul, excuse me. As after an exciting ending, as it was pulled from about 22 right there. As Hawksburgen drives in, he will get two right there. As after an exciting ending to the girls' game, in which the Hartley Melvin Sanborn girls won by two after a last second block shot. Yeah, the fans got to have some high expectations for this game. As the first shot by Hawksburgen is off. As Hawksbergen, with his second shot, is off the near side of the rim. As that'll be a Trinity Christian rebound, though. As they'll be going right back to the line tonight. As that is the third foul for the Hawks in the first 30 seconds. As this could be end up being a long quarter. And this could be one of those quarters that end up costing HMS one of those games. As Westra will bury the first one for his first points on the night. As they take an early 1-0 lead. As Wester with his second is good. As he'll go 2-for-2 two two at the line right there. Inbounded by Skip, skip Off. Skip Off to Cruz. Cruz. Up to Lesh. Lesh. Slowing it up a bit. Back to Cruz. Cruz will dribble it. Bury it from three. Or attempt to bury it as Billings pass to Van Beek. Skip Off with the three. As that is off, offensive rebound by Jaden Lesh. Kicked out to v Bradley Van Beek. That is also off. Still getting over the back here. On Alex Billing there going for the offensive rebound. As that is now their fourth foul in the first minute of the game. As Billings now has two in the first minute. As now getting checked in is George Vargas here. As that is an Aaron pass there by Wester as that'll go out in Trinity Christian doesn't even bother touching it because the second they touch it, a backcourt will be called. As Leighton skip off will be in here with the inbound to Cruz here. Cruz dribbling it up. Cruz over to skip off. Skip off. Drives in. So he'll be stripped there, but they will call that a reach in foul there. As that'll be the first foul committed by Trinity Christian tonight. As being dribbled, Cruz working. Cruz driving. Cruz will pull up with a little floater. That is off. That will be Hawks ball there. Or it'll be Tiger ball there, excuse me. Is it'll be it will be Hawks ball as one judge called it, one official called it one way. As here coming in is Zach Pearson here. Last night he I wouldn't if there was a definition of a performance called a choke. Last night was Vargas. He had over three feet of separation on five shots last night. As right there, just another open miss there. Skip off of the three. Is that will go in and be buried? They will take a three to two lead here, minute and a half in. As down low, pass getting tipped. Hawksburg goes up with that one. As that will be an and one opportunity. As the Hawks now enter, or the Tigers now enter the bonus here, just only two minutes in. Now, Jaden Lesh will come in and Zach Pearson will go out. Coach not too happy as Zach Pearson, like I was saying, had five shots last night with three or more feet of space and missed all five. As tonight, it is continuing. As he now, as Hawksburg will follow through with the and one play here. 
as he now has his first three on the night. Skip off, Leighton skip off. Cruz. Cruz dribble, skip off, skip off from three. Buried. As skip off as the first six for this game for the Hawks as they go up 6-5 here, just under two minutes into the ball game. As a nice little jump pass, there's a weird release there as George Vargas will get the rebound. Vargas, skip off. Lesh, back to skip off, skip off from three. That is off, rebound by Leash as they will get him with the foul on Trinity Christian is now foul plague start to this game there. As Leighton skip off will be inbounded, inbounded it to Cruz. Cruz drives in. Cruz pass out to Vargas. Vargas back to Cruz. Cruz driving as there will be some contact on the jersey there as that will be the third foul for Trinity Christian here just three minutes into this quarter. That score is 6-5, five, five minutes and 24 seconds left in the first quarter here in Hartley. It's Cruz. Van Beek for three as that is good as the Hawks are hitting on all cylinders start this game as Coach at Trinity Christian will take a time out here after the Bradley Van Beek three. We'll take one with them. We'll be back here in 30 seconds. This changes everything. TiVo is here. Search and control your cable channels and streaming video with one remote. Use voice activation to find everything faster or set a one pass recording. Then watch on any TV in your home or browse and view on Wi-Fi devices with the free View It app. Contact TCA to experience TiVo today. Wester to Reed. Reed grown away, bringing it up court. We'll call him by his first name because he plays with his brother. Number 10 is Corey Masson. Masson down low. As they will get HMS on the foul here, as they will be getting two shots at the line here. As Hawksbergen will take his first shots at the line, his second shots at the line here. As he now has four points here. Hawksbergen will miss his second one. Is that'll be he'll only make one of two here. As Bradley Van Beek for three, bang! There is the Hawks come falling through with the trend of only make threes. Is four threes to start this game. As that'll just be picked off by Bradley Van Beek here. As Cruz will bring it up here. Lane skip off kind of the. Floor general here. A skip off will drive in. Van Beek to Cruz. Cruz to Lesh. Lesh. Skip off. Just off. A little long. Here is offensive rebound attempt there by George Vargas here. As Reed, excuse me, Carter Wester will drive in there. As now Layton, as Layton Skipoff will fall to the ground. As HMS will commit a foul here, partly due to transition, and you wonder there if there should have been a travel called there because you can't fall to the ground and move with the ball. As Wester will be going to the line there. As they will take a substitution and try them out. As it will be a 30 second timeout. We'll stick with them here. As HMS is starting off hot. As they have buried all four of their threes here. 
to come off with an early 12-6 lead. Skip off in Van Beek in the story of the first quarter so far in as the Hawks have an early lead of 12-6 over the Trinity Christian Tigers and HMS. With At this point, if they come out firing like this, they won't have to play from behind. And they can eliminate the close game factor. So Wester will take its first shots at the line there. Wester's first one is up and good. He has three. His first two points were off of free throws. Can he make his first four points off of free throws? It's plus him. And that shot it will fulfill the prophecy. There is his first four all made off of four free throws there, right there. Skip off will inbound to Cruz. Has three minutes, 52 seconds left, left in the first quarter. Lash to Cruz. Cruz. Lesh, Lesh to skip off, skip off, pump fake, Cruz, Cruz, drives, uh, just moves his pivot foot, picks it up off the ground for a split second, that's just long enough to be called a travel there, 3.33 left in the first quarter, is bringing brought up here by Reed, Reed to Corey Masson, Hockenbergen, Hawksbergen, excuse me, Hawksbergen again, Osberg can pass down to 14. As that'll be brick card as that was Reed. Or, excuse me. That was James Postma in the game for the Trinity Christian. As skip off at the top of the key. Skip off driving. Will step back and hit that. As skip off is having himself the first quarter. As he now has eight. As I said coming into this, that they need the Hawks need to find a way to incorporate him into the game plan. As that'll be down to James Postma. As that'll be a foul, as they will have to earn his first two shots on the line here. As the Hawks have a 14 to 8 lead here to open up the game. As number 40, Evan DeYoung will take his first shots at the line. As that first one is off. As DeYoung with his second is off. In and out is nice block there by George Vargas. Cruz bringing it up here. So down a bit. Lesh loses control of the ball. Finds skip off. Skip off. Deciding what to do. He will kick out to Van Beek. Van Beek will pull it with room. As that is just off. As that will be Trinity Christian ball here. As they're saying that Lesh or Vargas stepped out of bounds trying to grab the ball. Thus bringing the ball out of bounds. Bringing it up here is Reed. Postma. Postma. Over to Reed. Reed to Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen driving with the fadeaway. That is off. Postma put that up. as nice block there by Jaden Lesh. As they will call that a travel there on the Trinity Christian Tigers here. As Zach Pearson will check back into this game. He will come in for Vargas. Just under two minutes left to go here in this first quarter. Skip off. Skip off. To Van Beek. Van Beek, skip off. Skip off, pump fakes. Goes up with the floater. That is no good there. As bringing it up here is Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen traveling. Hawksbergen to Postma. Postma, Reed, Reed. Hawksbergen once again. Hawksbergen. Over to Postma as HMS touches it, weirdly enough. As you wonder there if you let that bounce and take the odds that the officials don't call it in 
in Trinity's favor there as you have eight seconds to get a shot off here. As Hawksberger will drive in. As they'll call a blocking foul on Van Beek as he wasn't clearly set when he set the screen. As good draw foul there from Bradley Van Beek. As Billings will look to be checking back into this game possibly for Lesh. As Hawksberg in will make his first, make his second, third free throw of the game. As Billings will check in for Van Beek. Van Beek has three fouls here in the first quarter. Hawksberg in will go two for two. And he now has six. No other Trinity Christian player has a point right now in on the court right now. As skip off to Lesh. Lesh drives. Lesh will try and pass it in air. As they will call it HMS ball here. As they will say the pass went off a defender. As Cruz. Cruz time went to do. Lesh beats the step. Out to Pearson. Pearson driving. Pearson to Billings. Billings. Skip off in the corner. That is off. As Skip off gets back in transition. Bringing up here is Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen to Postma. Wester, excuse me. Hawksbergen, Postma. Back to Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen for three. That is just long as they will get HMS of a foul there. They will send them to the line once again with just under 35 seconds left. So on the next HMS or Trinity Christian possession, there will be no shot clock up. As the Hawks lead 14-10 here. And make that 14-11 here. As the young Barry says first. Dion for his second as he will go two for two at the line there. Cutting the HMS lead to two. As 30 seconds left, they will slow it up here. Try and milk as much time as possible. Skip off to Cruz. 28 seconds to go. Cruz to Pearson. Pearson to Vargas. Vargas will drive in. To skip off, skip off. Cruz, Cruz. Deciding what to do. Cruz to Vargas. Vargas will go up for that one. As that one is off, will be put back up by Billings. But that shot will be no good. As at the end of the first quarter, the Hawks will lead the Trinity Christian Tigers 14-12. to 12. As, we, as we enter the second quarter, we'll take a break. We'll be back here in 60 seconds here on Fuller Digital Solutions. Whether you are combining, hauling grain, or heating your home, fuel powers the fall. When it comes to energy, you need a company who is trustworthy, understands your needs, and who delivers to you. A company who is local, reliable, and affordable. That company is Ag State. Ag State Energy is clean, comfortable, convenient, while staying competitively priced for our customers. Give Laura Sanguin or Seth Duff a call for all your energy needs. At Century Mutual, we're always focused. As we'll actually stay here, as there is only about 10 seconds left until we start. As HMS will take a lead over Trinity Christian, 14 to 12, entering the second quarter here. As it is Hawks ball to start the second quarter. As skip off will inbound it here. Skip off to Cruz. Cruz. Skip off. Skip off. Dr drives. Is that will be picked? Hawksbergen bringing it up here. Hawksbergen will go up for it. Is that will be a foul there? on Vargas, and Vargas will pick up his third of the game. They'll call that a court foul. As 
Wester will inbound it here. Wester to Hawksbergen. Court foul once again on the Hawks here. Two fouls already, just 16 seconds into the quarter. So Wester a pass down low as that'll be buried by, I believe, Hawksburg in there. Ref blocking the way. As Hawksburg in, will score on that one. As... Ref's a little whistle for something there. Didn't quite notice it. Uh, Cruz bringing it up here. Skip off. Skip off to, Cru uh, to Vargas. Pearson. Pearson. They will get one of the HMS boys. They'll get Vargas for his fourth foul of the game. See, he's one away from disqualification here. As they might just play him out there to play him out there at this point. As wide open as Wester. Wester decided to take a contested mid range. That is good. A correct decision there. As he now has six in the game. As Cruz to skip off. Skip off. Pearson. Cruz. Out to skip off the three. That is off the near side there. Skip off tries to go for it. Cruz playing back off defense. Wester will go up for that one as he will have his eighth point here. As you wonder when the Hawks are going to call a timeout here. As skip off as the Hawks trail 18 to 14 here. Hawks have yet to score a basket in the second quarter. Cruz drives. Billings out to Vargas as that will be a backcourt violation on the Hawks here. That just adds on to the turnover virus as HMS will take a full timeout here. As we'll take one with them, we'll be right back. At Century Mutual, we're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual Reinsurance Company. El Grisma Agency in Sanborn, real estate and insurance. For 40 years, El Grisma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale will turn into sale pending soon. El Grisma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season, on and off the field and court. Contact El Grisma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at El Grisma Agency. Com. As we welcome you back to the second quarter of action here, I'm here not tonight, Bryce Williams, a junior at South O'Brien, just about 25 miles away. It's Hawksbergen at the top. Over to Postma. Postma to Wester. Wester will drive up with it as he just shot that up too hard as that'll be blocked once again as Wester will eventually kick that in as he now has 10 here. Just about uh, one and a quarter quarter into this game. Screws will kick out to Pearson. Pearson will go in. As they'll get him for a double dribble here as the turnover. They're just killing the Hawks here. They had such a, an amount of momentum coming out of the first quarter. As Kobe Dalma will come in for Pearson. The freshman coming in to sub out the senior. Dalma. Nervous, you can tell. As coming up with that, number 32. That is Young. As Young has his fourth point on the night. Screws skip off, skip off. Driving as they will get De Young with a foul here. That's his first of the game. Defense, 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 defense. 
skip off of the inbound. And then a Vargas, that'll be a five second violation on the inbound as if he cannot get it in five seconds. It is a turnover as HMS came into this quarter leading 14-12. And two and a half minutes into the quarter, they are trailing 22 to 14 here over the Trinity Christian Tigers. It's Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen driving. Hawksbergen. Pass down to DeYoung. DeYoung will go for that one as DeYoung will just bully his way underneath as he now has six. As three players have all 24 of the Tigers' points as they will get a jump ball there as the Tigers will take over. As Westra, Postma to the young. Down low to Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen will go for that one. And that is good. That is now his 10th point on the night. As Skip Off will just have to shoot up a shot. As Post Westra was bringing it up here. Westra lose possession, but Tigers are training. As they'll call that a travel on the Tigers there. As Cruz will bring it up here as the Hawks trying to get their first points about four minutes into the quarter. Skip off, skip off. Cruz, Van Beek in the corner. That'll hit off the side of the backboard. As Van Beek will hit the floor, but cr crazy pass out to Cruz there. As hopefully he's okay, and you got a good May for effort on that one. As Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen once again. As picked off by Skip Off here. Skip Off bringing it up court here. Cruz. Cruz to Westra. Or, excuse me, Cruz to Van Beek. As that will be air balled there. As they save and bounce, keep transition up. As Hawksbergen over to Westra in the corner. Westra will fire away from three. As that will be a Tiger foul here. Uh, substitution will come in as Vargas will check out and Jaden Lesh will come back in. And Cruz will bring it up here. Cruz. Pass out of bounds as the Hawks just cannot find anything to go on offense. They have not scored a point in a hot minute here. Three minutes and 15 seconds in, so at least coming up on five minutes of no basket. And Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen to Davlar. Davlar will drive up and put that one up as that is off. As they will get Trinity Christian with a foul. As I think if you're HMS, that's how you gotta play this game. You need the you need to get to the line find some way to create some points and get this offense flowing. Because, I mean, coming into this game, they're a momentum team. Last night, they'd fight to get it back down to nine points here. As Cruz bringing this up. Cruz. to Dalma, Dalma to Cruz, little brother of Abby Dalma, as he will trip, as that will be a foul on Trinity Christian there, as they will enter the bonus with three minutes of, two minutes of 43 seconds off in this second quarter here. Kobe Dalma and Skip Off are talking at midcourt. Cruz 
will bury the first point of the quarter for the Hawks as that'll get some a slight bit of momentum back. Spurs will have his first point of the night. As Trinity Christian will take a timeout, we'll take one with him. We'll be back here in about 30 seconds. Forget the ramps and hassles when hauling. They are built to tilt. Tilt bed trailers made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. We're excited to now offer one of the best tilt bed trailers on the market, ranging from 22 to 28 feet in length. And like everything we manufacture, these trailers are built to work, last, and make your life easier. Haul with confidence when you hook up to a tilt bed trailer made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. Visit us online today at HolsteinMFG.com. As we welcome you back to this second quarter of action, I'm your announcer tonight, Boris Williams, Jr. over at South O'Brien here. As it's currently 8-16 here in Hartley, Iowa here. The home of the Hawks. As the second free throw by Cruz is in. As Cruz will have his first point of the night. As Cruz, I believe, had 13 last night in the loss to Woodbury Central. As Hawksburg and nice little jump fade away right there. Remind me of Kobe Bryant right there. As he now has 12, I believe. As Cruz, Cruz doing his magic. Skip off, skip off. Skip off driving in. Skip off will fall. Get the pass off as Van Beek. Pass to Dalma, Dalma. We'll do it as we gotta respect the freshman for shooting as Hawksburg and in transition as he will dunk it here on the away court. There's that is getting the fans excited here. The away fans at least it's picked off again. That'll go out of bounds as HMS will take the ball over. As you see a uh, huge crowd of fans leaving the game for the HMS Hawks after that most recent dunk. Count of 14 all in the student section. Cruz, and it's not often you see a play like that from Hawksbury. And Hawksbury, the player that can do it, but skip off the three. Is that will fall just short. Hawksbury bringing it up. Hawksbury with another dunk as he is getting up there. As he now has 16 in the game after a second dunk. And they will get a Trinity Christian foul. As Hawksburg are making this personal now. Throwing it down like Vince Carter out there. As the Hawks have double the lead, double the points. As the Hawks trail double their points as the score is 32-16 here. As Lesh will take his two shots at the line. Lesh hoping for his first points of the game. That first one is off. As Cruz will check out for Vargas. As Dalma playing a lot for a freshman out there. I believe he is a freshman. He is indeed a freshman. As pass to Hawksburg and Hawksburg. Driving out. That is picked off by Lesh. Lesh, who made the free throw, scores now 32 17. Uh, skip off here on the outside. Just about a minute left to play here in this first half. Dalma. Dominal Lesh, Lesh down low to Van Beek. Van Beek to corner Vargas as that will be an air ball. As two canceling out fouls here. A little bit confused what happens on this. Hawksburg in here. He's the man of the hour. Two back-to-back -back dunks here on the way court. As Bradley Van Beek will sink his first points. As number 30, Kyle Wint Wienia is subbed into the game. As the officials having a little talk to Hawksburg over on the sidelines. 
as Van Beek for second is going. As he will make two, as he now has eight. Is it, that's his first basket since the first quarter. As they're swinging that ball around. As that is picked off by the Hawks here. As just about six seconds in the shot clock game clock. Left wide open in the corner as that is missed. As bringing that up here is Davlar. Davlar will pass over to Corona with Pierce. Pierce going to have it here about 20 seconds here. No shot clock as we are under 35. Pierce to Davlar. Back to Pierce. About 11 seconds back to Davlar. Davlar to Pierce. Pierce with a little step back has him on ice skates. As Pierce will go up with that one, as that is blocked. As skip off for harass the rebound, and that will be it for the first half here. Hawks Trail 1932 going into the halftime show, as I will have a halftime show with about two minutes left in overtime. We'll be right back after this short break here on Florida Solutions. MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Primgar, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rayner. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Direct Written Premium.
I chose the NCC CNA course because I just really liked the instructors and the entire NCC community, how welcoming everybody is. And I was able to take it in high school and get it done before I started college. The new facility here at NCC has been great. You've got every tool you can think of. You're never struggling to find something. Just the facility as a whole has been awesome. It makes the learning a lot more interesting and a lot more hands-on and it's just been great. Sanborn Savings Bank understands the best things grow with care and time. Sanborn Savings Bank is here not only to help you grow to your potential, but our entire community. From small beginnings to grand celebrations, Sanborn Savings Bank is here to support your journey every step of the way. This Christmas, let's celebrate growth, prosperity, and a bright future ahead. Sanborn Savings Bank, growing with you this holiday season and beyond. Savings Bank of Primgar, Hartley, and Lake Park has been serving Northwest Iowa for over 125 years, providing personal, hardworking, and friendly service to its customers and community. Savings Bank of Hartley offers personal, ag and business banking, online and mobile banking solutions, along with many lending options. Savings Bank loan officers will sit down and do the hard work to ensure you get exactly what you need. Stop by and see what they can do for you or visit them online at www.savingsbankia.com. Bisma Graphics in Sanborn, your one-stop sign shop for everything from vehicle wraps, lettering, fleet graphics, signs of all kinds, race car wraps, power sport wraps, banners, logo design, business cards, or even color change vehicle wraps. Everything is done in-house with top-of-the-line equipment. Stefan and Ashley C. Bisma employ an experienced and knowledgeable staff who are ready to work for you. To help get you noticed, visit cbisma-graphics.com. Find us on Facebook or call 7 712-729-7446. This changes everything. TiVo is here. Search and control your cable channels and streaming video with one remote. Use voice activation to find everything faster or set a one-pass recording. Then watch on any TV in your home or browse and view on Wi-Fi devices with the free View It app. Contact TCA to experience TiVo today. As we welcome you back to this halftime show, I'm your next director. As here, uh, first quarter was uh, dominant for the Hawks, although it only ended up with them up two. They started off guns a blazing for the first two minutes. They had scored 12 points, and then the second quarter hit. And they didn't score baskets until about three minutes left in the quarter. And Dustin Hawksberger uh, has dunked on back-to-back -back possessions here. Uh, though he did talk to the officials, so I don't think we'll see any more dunking from Hawksburg tonight. As, although it's exciting, in a way, court's kind of viewed as disrespectful. As we're just under a minute, uh, Brad Van Beek so far, the leading scorer here, tied with Slayton Skipoff here with eight points left. Josh Cruz, who I thought was going to have a lot more of an impact, has only two points so far. But Carter Westrup has eight points so far in this for the Tigers. Uh, Dustin Hawksberger has about 18, 16 points. And Luke DeYoung has six. So, and Carter Wester has 10. And so it's just been a very dominant performance as all, all 32 points are scored by three different guys. As uh, the Trinity Christian Tigers hope to keep this going into the second half here. Run away with this ball game and walk out of here with a win. And improve their record to 2-1 and one as HMS hopes to fight back. And HMS hopes to pick up their first game of the year. 
And I think this revolves around Leighton Skipoff's involvement in the offense. Skip off with the inbound here. Skip off. Drive in. Lesh. Jaden Lesh goes up with it as that is off. Billings. Nice post defense here. They haven't seen much of Billings on the court at all. As Kobe Dalma got a good, decent chunk of playing time here in this first quarter. First half, I should say. Toxburger. Nice little underneath pass. As blocked there by Van Beek. Uh, as they will call travel here on the Tigers as some fans are not too happy with that because it, in their head they uh, got away with that same call earlier in the game but 35 seconds in here Oxley 32-19 as Hawksbergen Hawksbergen down low is the young Hawksbergen drives pulls up mid-range and that is just off as that will be dumped down to Reed Bronewig as we'll call him Reed because he plays with his brothers he picks up his first point of the game on the basket as Cruz left can't quite hang on to it as Cruz so will drive in. Skip off, open on the perimeter. Skip off, going to work down low. Skip off will shoot that. That is just off. As Hawksbergen will bring it up here. Hawksbergen will drive up. A nice little Euro step right there. And that is money every day of the week. As. Hawksburger now is 18 here in the game. As Leth passed to Van Beek. Van Beek open, passed to an open Leth now. Leth will drive in. He will get stripped of that. As coming up with that is Pierce. Pierce bringing it up here. Pierce giving it to Reed. Brothers there, I believe. As Reed to Pierce. Pierce to Hawksburgen. Hawksburgen. We'll get under to Reed. Reed will fire away as Pierce will go underneath as they will say that he stepped out of bounds and that'll be a turnover resulting in HMS ball here. Vargas will check in for Billings that they're going to go for agile lineup here as Van Beek can move up and down the court for being a 4-5. As Cruz drives in, Cruz pass out to skip off, skip off to left, left driving, left goes up with it. That's just off Vargas with the putback. As that is off, as nothing will fall for HMS there. As Westra with a kind of alley up there, uh, just can't quite put it in. That's Cruz there to skip off, skip off. Skip off the side, new pass to finds Van Beek. Van Beek to left, left. To skip off on the rifle of a pass. As Cruz, Cruz driving. Van Beek wide open for three. Van Beek's going to pop that as that goes in and out. That's kind of been the story for the Hawks thing, just going in and out. As Hawksburgen goes up for that one, no contact called there. As someone's going to fall on the ball. This is like a rugby scrum as it will be a foul on Trinity Christian that will result in HMS getting the ball. As bringing it up here is Skipuk. Or Skipuk. Skip off, excuse me. As Kobe Dalma is back in the game. Dalma to Van Beek as that'll stay in. Hawksbergen bringing it up here. Hawksbergen with a nice little layup as that is 20 here.
That's now 20 here for Hawksbergen. One skip off. As Billings will check in here for Van Beek. As left, left. Vargas will drive. They will call a foul on Trinity. Christian here. 341 left to play here in this third quarter. Hawks trailed the Trinity Christian Tigers 38-19 here in the third quarter. As Vargas here with the inbound. Left, left driving. They will call a foul on Trinity once again as Hawks have not played any, has not had any fouls this quarter as Vargas only has one left to get before he is out of here. As would not want a player like Vargas coming out of this game as Vargas with the inbound. Vargas will come over to left, left. Back out to Vargas, Vargas. To Dama. Dama. Skip off. Skip off. A little spin. As left in the corner. Left will let that go. As that is off of Will getting over the back here on Billings here. As Bradley Van Beek is checking back into this game. See who will come in for Billings here. As we're getting situated, making substitutions here. As they were calling a legal, they were calling a legal screen here. As now the Hawks will enter the bonus here. As skip off, skip off at the top of the key. Lesh, Lesh, Lesh going in. Lesh will pull up as Vargas will fight for that offensive rebound. That cannot go seem to make its way in as we are now five minutes. Five and a half minutes into this quarter, and no points have been scored by the Hawks yet. As nice little step through right there. As left will keep that. Skip off will come up. Skip off. As left. Left here. Skip off to Van Beek in the corner. Van Beek will pop that for three. That is off the near side of the glass. Is in transition is Hawksbergen. That will be out of bounds as they will keep that inbounds. HMS will as Vargas will bring it up the court here. Have the pass from Dama. Vargas. Vargas over to left. Left with the moving three. Is that is off as Postma will grab the board. Hawksbergen will bring it up here. As Vargas will pick this pass off. As Trinity will play some defense on there. A little bit rougher defense. As with 128 left here in the third quarter. Could the Hawks score the first, their first points of the third quarter here with a minute and 28 left. As Davlar will check out here for Masson. As Vargas will sink the first point of the quarter. Vargas now has one point in the game today. As Vargas with the second. And that is up and no good. Vargas will only come away with one here as the Hawks reach the 20 mark. 
as Hawksbergen. Hawks out to Hawksbergen. Hawksbergen will drive in. He'll fade away as that was almost the definition of a Kobe play right there. As Hawksbergen will end up falling on that. Excuse me, that was uh, Luke Young falling on that. As Trinity Christian will take a timeout, we'll take one with him. We'll be right back here in 60 seconds. Century Mutual. We're always focused on dedicated, personalized service for you. Serving customers in 27 Northwest Iowa counties for over 130 years. As a proud Grinnell Mutual member insurance company, we'll be there when you need us most. Helping protect all that's important to you, including your future. With Grinnell Mutual, you can trust in tomorrow. Contact your local Century Mutual Insurance Association agent today. Located in more than 50 local communities. Trust in Tomorrow is a registered trademark of Grinnell Mutual Reinsurance Company. As we get situated out on the floor, as HMS will also take a full timeout, so we will take one with them and we'll be right back here. Elgersma Agency in Sanborn, real estate and insurance. For 40 years, Elgersma Agency has been helping clients sell homes, businesses, farms, and more. Using strategic marketing, your for sale will turn into sale pending soon. Elgersma Agency is proud to be a part of the HMS community and supports the Hawks all season, on and off the field and court. Contact Elgersma Agency when you're ready to sell. Visit us online at elgersmaagency.com. Forget the ramps and hassles when hauling. They are built to tilt. Tilt bed trailers made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. We're excited to now offer one of the best tilt bed trailers on the market, ranging from 22 to 28 feet in length. And like everything we manufacture, these trailers are built to work, last, and make your life easier. All with confidence when you hook up to a tilt bed trailer made at Holstein Fabrication and Holstein Manufacturing. Visit us online today at HolsteinMFG.com. As we welcome you back here on Fuller Digital Solutions, Hartley, Melbourne, Sanborn. I am your notch tonight, Bryce Williams. It's Hawksburn will go up with that one. I'm a junior at South O'Brien. It's Hawksburn will go up with that one, playing bully ball as a rebound battle down low. Jaden Left will come up with that. As Cruz, Cruz to Vargas, Vargas. We'll go up with that as Vargas is off. Rebound Van Beek. Van Beek will grab his own rebound. And he will be fouled. As Van Beek would make his way to the line. There's only one point scored in this quarter for the Hawks here. As Bradley Van Beek will miss his first one. As he will make the second one, it's two points total scored in the quarter. As he now has nine points in the ball game. That's just about a one second difference separating the shot clock and game clock here. As that will be rebounded there by Trinity. They'll call a travel on Trinity Christian here. It's 38-21 here in Hartley. 23 seconds left, no shot clock as we are under 35 seconds here remaining in the second quarter. Third quarter, excuse me. Cruz out back, that'll be stripped by Luke DeYoung. 
Hawksburg and we'll go up with that one is that is good. Is Hawksburg and now is 22. So play for last shot. Vargas will put that up as the time goes off. As that was a all Trinity Christian quarter as only HMS only scored, managed to score two points as a Trinity man scored 13. We'll be right back here after this short break here on Florida. MHI and CUSO of Cherokee are on the move, expanding, and in need of residential treatment workers, psychiatric security specialists, and LPNs. We deal with disorders that you can't see. You get to help people who are in desperate need of help, and helping those people actually helps the community as well. The benefits here, I think, are top-notch. That was why I came here. To learn more and to apply, visit governmentjobs.com. For over 80 years, Farm Bureau Financial Services has served the unique needs of the ag industry. As members of your community, we get to know you and your operation, providing coverage for your farm, ranch, machinery, livestock, and so much more. Find out why we're the number one ag insurer. It's your future. Let's protect it. In Primgar, your Farm Bureau agent is Danielle Rader. Number one ag insurer across our eight-state territory. 2018 SNL PNC Group Direct Written Premium. As we welcome back here on Four Those Solutions for the start of this fourth quarter, Hawksburg will throw it down to Luke DeYoung. DeYoung will go up for that one. That's tip. As Left will bring it up, Left by himself. Left will go up for it. As that will be blocked, but they will call goal pain on that one. As Hawksburg goes up for that, as they in the first 14 seconds, HMS already matches their points of the last quarter. As Cruz basket will be attributed to Jaden Leth here. Luke the young will go up for it, except that will be a ground foul, so no and one for Sunday. As Jimmy, it will be an and one, and one opportunity here for Luke the young here. As he will make the end one, as he will now have nine on the game. As 7.25 left to go, Vargas will go up for that one, as Vargas will score here. As he now has three in the game. As Ho Hoaxbergen, Hoxbergen pass is deflected, Kobe Dama now in the game. As that pass will be deflected by Dama, Cruz bringing it up here. Great defense, though, as Dama will catch the pass as Cruz will go up for that one. And Vargas, excuse me, will go up for that one. And he is now as five as the Hawks fell only by 16 here. As Hawksbergen will go up for that one. And what a nice daily roll on that one. As Cruz to left, left will drive in and they will call a foul on Trinity Christian. Is now coming into the game is Pierce. Kobe Dama will be inbounding. Inbound to Cruz. Cruz. Vargas. Vargas will go for that one. Van Beek will make up for it though as he tries to grab his own board. As playing some rough defense down there in the trenches. That's what we like to call the paint is Hawks. Hawksbergen is having himself a game 26 points still with 6 and 620 to play as Zach Pearson is preparing to check into this game probably for Colby Dama as Dama Dama going Cruz calling for it left will get it left will drive left will pull up for that and that is off rebound by George Vargas though as Cruz will Try and make a play. Vargas open for three. Drives in. He will go for that one as Vargas now has seven points here. Quickly becoming the second leading scorer or the third high scorer for the Hawks. Is that three by Hawksburg is off 
as Hawks trail by 18, five and a half minutes left in the game. Cruz. Cruz, Vargas. Cruz driving. Kobe Dama to Vargas. Vargas will bring that in. Hawksburg, he's running in transition. As they will call Hawksburg with the travel here. As Kyle Wiena will come in for Luke DeYoung. As bringing it up here for the Hawks is Cruz. As Dalma will check out here. As left wide open for three, is it, that is overshot here. Bringing up here is Corey Masson. Masson will give it to Hawksbergen, just under five. Pierce. They will call a foul on Hartley Melvin Sanborn here. As Pierce will inbound here. As Hawksbergen will inbound here. Hawksbergen will drive in. Hawksbergen will go up for it. As that is 28. As he is a basket away from 30 here tonight. Vargas will clank off the rim here. As Hawksbergen bringing it up here a little bit with a slower pace though. As he will pass though Kyle Wenya here. As the crowd goes wild. As Wenya scores his first basket of the game. Hawksburg and defending as they will say he stepped out of bounds there. As coming out now is Evan DeYoung and coming in now is Trey Boogard. Pass over to Masson. Pierce, Pierce driving. Pierce will shoot that. Flanked off the back of the board. Cruz just on just four left to play. As Cruz will drive. Brick wall there by Hawksbergen. That shot is off the back of the board as Ho they will just chuck that up to Hawksburg. Hawksburgen will go up in there. And he will get 30. As that is 30 on the night here. As Vargas there with a high steal there clanked off the back of the board. That's how high the steal was. Wania has it over to Hawksbergen. Masson will go up for it and he'll be fouled. He'll be awarded two shots here. As Van Beek will come out. And Dama will come in. The first shot is good. Sank by Corey Masson. Masson with the second. Is good. As Billings will come in and Vargas will come out. As Billings will inbound it here. Billings, I haven't seen much of him tonight. Entered foul trouble early. Same could be said for Vargas, but Vargas stayed in the game. He had four fouls since the first quarter. And Cruz will drive. Cruz kick out to Pearson. Pearson will go up. Pierce will drain it. And that's Pearson's first basket over the last two games. As Wenya will go up with that one. And Wenya, that shot will be off. As Wenya out to Pierce. Pierce will go up for that one. Pierce will score here. As that's his first basket on the night tonight. As just about 2.30 left to play here. As Kobe Dama pass will be just behind him. As the young freshman will be getting this time.
is Hawksbergen and Pierce will both take a seat. Hawksburg checking out of this game with 30 points. Scored over half of his own team points as Weenie will pop up for three. Weenie has shot almost there. As they will call a jump ball as Billing protecting that like a lineman at the bottom of the football pile right there. As Cruz bringing this up, just under two and a half left to play here. Cruz, ball tip. Kobe Dama would like to see him get a basket tonight for the young freshman. Leth. Leth kicking it to Dama. Dama will pop it. Shot is off as Wenya with the board. As Reed. Weenie will just let that ball go out of bounds. It just went right past him. As bringing it up here with just under 145 left in the game is Cruz. As Pearson will be awarded two shots here at the line. as Pearson at the line. As Pearson's first shot is off. As Pearson's second shot is also off. Offensive rebound by Billings. That'll be jump ball. As Wienia will be awarded the possession there. Pass to Wienia. Wienia. Down low. As Trey Booger will go up for that one. He'll be awarded two at the line here with just 130 left. Trinity Christian leads 57-31 here a minute and 30 seconds left in this ball game. And Booger's first shot is off. Booger's second one is also off. Rebound by Kobe Dama. Dama bringing it up here. Dominant Pearson, Pearson. Trying to get it to Billings down low. They'll call a jump ball. That'll be the Hawks ball with 118 left. As Pearson. Pearson puts that up. As that is good, as Pearson now has four on the night. As nice block there by Jaden Leth. Leth will now be the one to score here and Leth will get the basket here as he now has five on the night. As with just 45 seconds left. Wester has the ball. Mawson. Over to Reed. Reed. As Wester will go up with that one. As Wester will rebound that. As what a miracle shot right there. He can make those. And he just proves right there he can. As... HMS will be awarded substitution that Pearson and Billings will check out. And now coming into the game is Carter Dolphin and Brody Mendering. And also in the game now is Grant Kunzman. As Leth going up with that one. Last shot is off. Four shots left. We are going up for it. And we... 
Weenie shot will be done. That will be the final score of the game. As Weenie now has four on the night. It's not much of a post game here from Hartley tonight. But we can say one name that will sum up this game. And that is... And that is... Justin Hawksbergen. As he was the main scorer tonight. As that's all here from... Hartley Melvin Sanborn. We'll see you guys next time. Everyone have a good night and a good weekend.